Dork Souls, the dorkening. I will be dorkening with my good friend and master of mayhem, Mazurf. Hi, Mazurf. Hi. I'm here. Mazurf, what do you said? Mazurf is 700 levels higher than I am in this game. And he wow. is, he is uh, decidedly more skilled than I am. But that is why he is here. He is the, for example, we're gonna watch this encounter right here. And I just got owned a little bit. And I, I probably could have done better. But I'm, but I'm, but I just, I'll listen to your critique after. <laughs> well, my critique is very simple. Can you figure out what it is from the last one of these streams? Don't die. Roll. Oh, roll into the guy? Yeah, roll to the roll to one of the sides as he's about to attack, especially on these guys. That leaves his back really open for getting a few hits in before he moves around. Can you get, with this guy, can you get yeah. up? Hey, man. How hey you there. doing? Pretty good. We're just uh, starting a little uh, dork souls here. I'm a... Uh, cool. I will be the uh, class clown, and you guys are the you guys are my wise advisors. Um, nice. <clears throat> probably. Well, what, what are you up to? Uh, that's a good question. Uh, he am, looks like he's in the undead settlement. Yeah, I'm in undead okay. settlement, and I'm uh, level twenty eight. Okay. So. Well, oh, look at this little guy. Hey, my little wife guy. just got home. My wife just got home, so I'm, I actually got to get going. Oh, okay. Well, hey. But was good. <laughs> I'll be on a little later. Okay. All well, right. I'll, I'm cool. going to be on for an hour or two. So. Okay. All right, cool. Well, I may well, or may not see you then. Okay. <laughs> well, good. Thanks for All dropping right. in. <laughs> see yeah. you later. Later. All right. So, uh, anyway. Well, there's two of us, and there might be three of us. Who knows? So, I'm... I uh, I just opened the sewer grate. I killed a giant rat. I'm cut is honestly, like. Uh, well, there's a couple of different bonfires in here. That shortcut is partially there for going down into the sewer once you buy the sewer key. Oh. Uh oh. Hey rat. Hey giant rat. So um. I have been using my shield. I've been using a lot of, uh, I've been using a lot of crossbow, and air bow and arrow. I'm actually a huge fan of sniping uh, guys from far away and taking out some of my problems. No shame in that. I'm glad to hear that there's no shame in that, because <laughs> uh, I do a lot of it. Because I am, oh hey, I'm dork souling here. I'm having nachos, yeah. by the way. They're they're pretty good. Hi, everybody. Nachos. Nachos? They're nacho nachos. Um, I would hope not. How's everybody doing? I see there's a few people joining us. Hello. I'm not sure who yet because I'm not in the actual room. I probably should uh, jump into the room and see if I can find where my, my game link is. <laughs> Might be a good move there, G-Man. Uh, I wish it was... Uh, I could... I guess Excuse it just... Me. It creates a custom link every time. So... Yes. So I have to go... I have to go in and figure that out. But anyway. Oh, here we go. Well, and it, it's kind of funny with the YouTube streaming from the PS4 because the... Uh, if you go under your channel and the whole streaming hub center thing, it doesn't show up right in there. Oh, yeah, so, yeah, it's very, it's weird, it's, I don't know, I, I feel like they need to do some optimization and such on the YouTube streaming from your PS4. Yes, darn it. Hey, to oh, I see Toast is here, and what's up, Ed? Hello. So we've got a few people joining us uh, for Dork Souls tonight. Um, so, I guess... I'm not sure what my mission is tonight. Let's 
Uh, let me jump into... I don't know. Uh, I guess I could go to my bonfire so you could see sort of what I have in my bonfire maze. And then you could sort of tell me, uh, hey, you haven't haven't discovered that thing yet with the stuff. The thing with the stuff. Well, uh, have you gone up the tower? Yes, and I made friends with the giant at the top of the tower. That was awesome. So, 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 you, so you met Onion, bro. So you met Onion, bro. <gasps> His name's Onion, bro. Oh, like <laughs> his name is Siegward, but uh, it, it's an epic, e epic name, bro. The guy I talk about for Dark Souls stuff he calls him Onion, bro, and oh, that's he's funny, Onion, bro. I love my because he's he's... he's kind of a callback to Dark Souls One. Oh, ooh, I don't remember that. Is he like a? Uh, was he in Dark Souls One? Yeah, well, not him exactly. There was Siegmeier in Dark Souls 1. He, he was a very similar kind of character, sort of a bumbling knight. He, one of the mm. best characters ever. I totally don't remember that. Um, well, what I do remember from this one is getting through that little graveyard was brutal hard <laughs> until I found out that you could make friends with the knight on top. So, um, Oh, yeah. Quick. It, yeah, him shooting the arrows will kill the sh arc out of you. <laughs> Eddie, I know who you are. <laughs> I know who you are. Um, uh, as people show up, I'm going to explain a few things that I've discovered. How many of you... So, Toast, I know that Maze is playing. Eddie and Toast, are you guys playing? You can just say yes or no. But I'm just curious curious of who's who's here and what what you guys have done so far and or not done or whatevs i could explain what i've done but it would be very spoilery so we'll yeah don't say thank you nope so i don't know i guess i i need to go do something what's what's cool to do around here well did you help did you help onion bro fight the demon what? Oh, I did find like a dragony demon that I killed, and there was a. Wait, wait. Is Onion Bro the giant? Are you talking about the giant, or are you talking about like? No, no, no. Onion oh, Bro is the guy the in the funny looking armor. Yeah, yeah, yes. yeah. Yes, I did, and we defeated that dragon creature demon. It was awesome. The, he did the most of the work. Question is, yes. The bigger question, though, is: Did you get the toast gesture? I think I did. Okay, good, because that is the single most important, most awesome gesture you could ever possibly get. Okay, well, I need to go ahead and equip that. <laughs> <laughs> but um, uh, if that's done, there's sure. there's some items and such you could get, or if you want to go fight the boss, you could go fight the boss. Where's my... Uh... Sort of depends. I don't know exactly how much of the area you have... Uh you've explored where's the okay which one is it welcome wave jump for joy point down point up point forward hurrah bow toast there toast. it is <laughs> as toast says it's the toast gesture you need to get it and toast so I got nothing in my hand, which is a little weird. Yeah, but it's awesome. After every every time I do a co-op and fight a boss with somebody, I always do that before I uh, end up disappearing out of their world. So I probably don't need to go back through here, do I? Back through where? Should I go back through the sewer well, or should I go somewhere else? Here's the big question. Have you, have you found the pyromancer? That's actually something you need to do. Yeah, he's across the bridge over here, right? Like, um, in, yes, yes, I have. Okay. He was in a cage. He was in a little, ca little okay. metal cage, right? Yes. yes. I did find I, the pyromancer. I'm not proud to say that I ended up missing him for quite a large majority of the game myself. I was he's, not proud of myself. Well, he's in a like a little, you know, like you could totally he's, miss that. I see. There's a Kinda lot of things hidden. like that. There's a lot of hidden things. Hi, honey. Bye, you, honey. Uh, <laughs> okay. 
Hmm. Um, um, have you opened up the the uh, shortcut door, or do you still have to go through the side to get up to the boss then? Because that's basically all that should be left for you to do here. Where would I go? Where is there a way to find that? How do you find that? Well, oh, um, uh, okay, through the graveyard, right? Yeah, through the graveyard, or you can go through the sewer and you can just walk right up the path, right to the front door to see if it's open. But um, either way works fine. The graveyard might be a little simpler because there's not one of those uh, fat ladies there. The fat lady. I call that the fat fryer. It reminds me of the fat fryer from uh, from um, uh, the, uh, the, the, the evangelist. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. The uh, ones that e were be just the same thing. Yeah, that totally. I mean, it was the exact. I think they're called the. I think they're called the evangelists. Actually. They are. They're evangelists right? from the Cathedral of the Deep. I love my friend that now kills these guys for me. It's really nice. You're about to die, my friend. Your friend? Yep. My oh, large... yeah, the giant. Uh, Shrek? Oh, no. Oh, no. Seriously? I seriously just got hit what? by you? I just got hit by the lamest guy. <laughs> a little embarrassing, actually. You're about Dark to see Souls, it. where you go and you kill a 50-foot-tall, giant, weird boss of doom, and then get killed by a guy with a pitchfork. Yes! That is one of the particularly humiliating parts of playing Dark Souls. I love oh, watching yeah. these guys get totally racked up, though. It's... Yes, it's fun. So, if anyone's watching and, and wondering uh, some strategies or some tips, uh, I'll tell you, my first early strategy was whoa hey bro it's me it's me bro it's me why did you throw that at me that was a little disturbing so um i'm gonna let him take care of this guy too because i know he wants to throw stuff at them he really likes to throw things it's kind of his thing it's frank i to hit you once you uh once you've made made buddies with him he could hit you dead on with the arrows and oh do no damage, am i so. impervious hello big fat kitty have a big fat kitty in my lap who's just very happy that I'm home and just wants to just wants to cuddle oh forgot about you oh my son discovered the coolest thing that all most of these regular guys you just roll into them and they yep. they're stunned and stagger yeah oh yeah it makes some of this part a lot simpler because if you really feel like it you can actually run oh did you get the mortician's ashes? Yes, and I gave them to. Okay. I'm. I'm gonna. I know that that's a good mission to do. The, uh, the the quest line, I guess, to go hollow, right? Yeah, that one's not bad to do. Sorry, I, I'm for some weird reason something weird is happening, and it's weird. But um. If you want to yeah, come in that's... and help me beat this boss, man, I would be certainly willing to accept your help. Y you don't want to try at least one time. To sure. see if you can do it yourself? Uh, I guess I could. Do you suggest using a shield or two-handing my, my axe here? Uh, two-handing, because the thing with this boss is, is uh, even more so than Udix, it's all about dodging. I know I say that all the time, that is like my mantra, but it, this thing basically has a bunch of weak points that you have to hit, because hitting it anywhere else will do no damage. It's like all the little egg sacks, right? Mm hmm And does he just basically respawn these guys forever? Yeah, every... Well, once you once you get him low enough and you fall through the ground, he uh, they stop respawning. Oh, that's good. Because they're really irritating. Yeah, they can be. So wait, you fought him already once, then? Uh, my son has, and he... I don't think we've... I don't think we've experienced victory. <laughs> Ah, he's like, okay. He's, oh. he's not particularly tough. He's just kind of annoying with the whole having to hit the weak points thing. So it's it, it's a fight that you can't just try to brute force because that will ah. work. You kind of got to be a little bit careful. Well, there you go. And dead. Oh, you... <laughs> Welcome to Dork Souls, everybody. Welcome to Dork Souls. <laughs> okay, G-Man. If, if you want aid, let me sit here and uh, 
set up that password we agreed upon. Oh yeah, what do I have to do? Can I just put it in? I guess this is a... Uh, so I should just head over there first, right? What's the quickest way to get up there? This? Or is there a... Have I opened a, a um, link up there, maybe? What do you mean? I mean, have I already sat down somewhere where it's going to be faster to get there? Like, uh, is it faster? This is the fastest way, but stay near the bonfire up until uh, we get summoned. Oh, okay. Because I'll put my summon sign down here. Uh, capital or lowercase on that password? Um, lowercase. But what do I have to do? I don't. I haven't you put have anything put in yet also. either. Oh well. I guess everyone's going to see it, or oh, will it be hidden? Well. I, I don't know, but it's not like it's going to hurt. I, yeah. I don't think anybody watching right now owns the game, and you'll be able to tell my summon sign over. Okay. So, um, how do I do this? What do I use oh, to it, do such a thing? It's go in my inventory. Into the, go into the menu. Oh, menu. Yeah, and it's it's in the actual options menu. Can't fit the entirety of it, though. Um. Oh, I see. Password. Oh, okay, all right. So we're just going to put the whatever part of it we can fit. Uh, so, all right. right. What was it? Oh, yeah, okay. <laughs> all right. Now you're going to need to, uh, you are going to have to ember yourself, so you're going to have to uh, use one of those items. Okay, so inventory. So you can summon me. Ember. Oh, so oh, okay. So I'm gonna hit that now. Mm-hmm. Use. All right. I'll put down my summon sign. It's right near the bonfire. It'll say Shrell is my name. Shrell. I'll have a big sword. I see someone with a sword, and it's orange. I see purple. I see. Oh, wait, I'm not near the bonfire, though. Let me get closer to the bonfire. Yeah, it's, like, off in the grass to oh, the, crap. uh... Oh, crap. I've been invaded, too. Uh... Ah, oh, crap. Crouch summon... I see summon oh, of sign... Of course. How do I know it's you? It, my name will be Shrell Fay. That's me. Okay. Hey, there we go. I see Tony, the guy yeah, over there. Quickly. Try not to die. I'll come help you. I ah, see... Quickly. The... I see the guy. He's over... Ah. He's kind of hanging out over there waiting. Come on. Come on, summon me. Uh, I summoned you. I'm coming oh, in. All right. I know. I I got to wait for it to work. Erg. All right. Uh, oh, yeah. He's an NPC invader, not a real human being. Oh. Shall we? <laughs> I can't go up, G-Man. All right. Let's go. This guy shouldn't be too bad. Except when I don't dodge, right? Oh, oh, meanwhile... Oh, I'll take the big guy. Now, it did lower my level a bit to be closer to you, so I'm not as awesome as I am. But I'll take this bigger thing really quick. Oh, crap. I am getting... Coming in. Coming in. Ah! Can we hurt each other or no? No. No. We're, uh, we're cooperators. We cannot hurt each other. Oh, well, that's nice. There we go. Take that, chump. Woohoo! Oh, vertebrae shackle. I don't know what that is. It's, what? uh, it's for what? No, go ahead. So what is it? It's an item for one of the covenants. Oh, uh, okay. Are you a part of a covenant? At the moment, if you notice, I'm all glowy and yellow. Yes, I, I do a see that. Uh, well, I, uh, I'm a warrior of sunlight. That's so cute. I could be, like, 12 or 13 different things. But at the moment, this is what I am. Hey, dude. Hey, man. I, I know. I know you can't hurt me right now, but you could like not shoot right on top of me. It oh, is a little. You, <laughs> you should probably pay attention. Yeah. Watch out for that one Give guy with a sledgehammer. 
Now, what do you get? What is a um, Titanite shard? Sweet. What is um? What do you get as a a, a, a help like a helper? Do you earn experience? Um, do you? I uh, I it, I do get for helping you beat the area boss. Oh, awesome. Well, let's go and beat the boss. Gods, I I feel so weird. I have so such, such a small amount of health right now. Uh, I've noticed this also. The only thing that I can say, Toast, is just refresh. I don't know if it's G-Man's end or our internet. Oh yeah, I'm sorry. Is there is there a bunch of you guys experiencing crappy, crappy play, from the? Yeah, I don't. It, like I said, I can't. I can't hundred percent tell if it's the internet problems or if it's a stream. Like, because you have yours popped up on your screen, does it look like there's being a problem? Uh oh. Mark Jackson's just, in the house. It looks like it just dropped you. Did it? Maybe it kicked him out for Mark Jackson. Hey, Mark Jackson. Let us know if you're having streaming problems. Yeah, that'd be kind of not cool. Oh, I'm going to get my souls back, too. Yes, please. All right. Uh, so, let's try to be careful. Don't get too close to the boss until we kill some of the little guys. Oh, okay. I thought he keeps dropping guys. Like they're falling does, out of the sacks. If, okay. Not till later. But uh, if we kill these ones before that, if we can, if we do it right, we'll be able to um, get him to drop into the second phase before... Uh, okay. Oh. For some reason, he started... They might have changed it in a patch so he starts out earlier. I could see them doing that. It's all right. Just watch him and dodge when you need to. Like right now. But yeah, all of his... I don't know if they're egg sacks or what they are. That's what I think of him as. Oh, and it didn't do any damage to me, so I must have dodged right, but... Are you dodging back or are you dodging like inwards? Uh, inwards, the left or the right. It sort of depends on what attacks he's doing. When he Watch does out. that that what roll thing, it's so crazy. All right. Yeah. Oh 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 oh! Get him in the nuts. Got his nuts. Oops. Okay, that did no damage. I just did zero damage. Yeah, you gotta make sure you hit him in the, uh, any, any of the weird little... Oh! oh there we go. He's gonna fall right on Second me. Second phase. <laughs> Alright. Anywhere you see the egg sack. Now be careful, because he just got his, uh, his little arm. Oh, yeah, the... It reminds me a lot of the, um... Uh... What is that creature? The amygdala. Amygdala? Yeah, Amygdala. Yeah, it kind of. Ow, ow. Bastard. Oh, crud. Can I hit him in the back Yeah, at try all? to stay... Yeah, he's got something in the back. Try to stay behind him, actually, as much as you can. Get away. Because it's... Those are the best ones to hit right now. Oh, I'm getting, like, acid. Yeah, he, uh... A little acid, but it does a meager amount of damage, so it's kind of. Oh, roll away. Because he's coming back. Oof. Oh, I'm chopping his All hand right. real good. Yeah, the hand is another good one to hit. Uh, I, I'm, I'm sure everyone's having fun. Listening to the ah uh, ah uh, hit that spot ah uh, ah uh, hit that spot. <laughs> this thing is huge, everybody. I mean, look at this. Look at this guy. He's dropping sacks. All We're right. hit. I think I'm going to start going for the front. Oh, roly poly. Oh, he he, just... he roly polyed. All right, got one of the ones on the foot. Attack the hand. I'm trying to find like where he's. Ooh, I think we both... Oh, there you go, G-Man. Woo! 
I love I co-op. <laughs> I hold on. I also toast you. And if toast were here, we would toast toast. We would toast the happy heck out of toast. And I got a soul of rotten grit. Now, do you cash those souls, or do you save them for infusing into a weapon later? What is your stance um, on on this? I always level up before I upgrade weapons. But then again, upgrading weapons doesn't take all that many souls, so I would say level up. So just you spend them and level up. Okay. Now where's my uh, where's my fire? Oh, there it is. I have gone into a room and not lit the bonfire and died and had to go all the way back, and that was... Needless to say, that was really sad. I'm kind of sad that you don't get to stay with me. So as soon as you defeat a boss, it, it like instantly banishes the other. Yeah, but I'm I'm not sure if you can summon me back up in this area. You may be able to summon me back up here to help you more, or you need to get to the next area and you can summon me there. One easy way to check will be once you go level up. Yeah. So should I offer the vertebrae sample at this altar? Does that do anything for me? Or if push? you want to. You don't have enough of them for it to actually affect your uh, standing with this covenant, so... It's just like a starting... You... Yeah. Well, and you actually missed out on... And don't worry about it, so did I. You actually missed out on uh, actually joining the covenant in the easy way anyways. Oh. But it, it's a PvP covenant, too, so it's not like it's probably something you're gonna worry too much about yeah i'm not i'm not doing a bunch of pvp are you doing a lot of that though uh i i do some here and there it's not like my main thing but like i had a i had a fun time with this guy the other day he summoned me up into this one area and we just sat there and ganked a bunch of dudes for like an hour or so it was, it was quite fun are there any secrets in here that i should discover no or there's that nothing it? down there okay yeah no nah, there's there's nothing down there. I see all the... I like all these people. <laughs> all the messages. Yeah. I like how they leave messages about how to fight the boss in a place where you can only see them after you fight the boss. Yeah. It's kind of... It's kind of irritating. Okay. Really helpful there, guys. <laughs> Thanks a lot. Not at all. Travel. Let's go on back to Firelink Shrine. I have You're been making time and then you come back and they'll say something different or you've done something and it makes yeah. them happy or sad and so they'll talk to you in a different way and yeah <sighs> some of the guys in the uh some of the guys at firelink don't don't have as many conversation different conversation things as i'd kind of hope but they're okay and and who is there anyone so Jackson, does anyone know why the picture is so poor? I don't. I don't know why the picture is so poor tonight. Ah, I'm sorry. If it's, Maybe it's try, me. Just Maybe it's try me. refreshing everybody, and if that helps. Because a lot of times, it's not necessarily your end. It might be their end. Like like I said, you, you have your stream popped up so you can see it, right? Because you're looking at the chat and yeah. everything. Yeah, I saw it go a little right. funky at one point. It got a Are little you seeing pixel. a lot of that? Uh, like right now, I just saw some of it. Yeah, it is a little pixelated. The thing is, is there's not really anything you can do necessarily to help that. The only real thing you could do would be to get stronger internet. So I, I have pretty good internet, so I'm wondering what I'm wondering what the dealio is. Funny weather or something, maybe. Maybe. Maybe, or I, I don't know, maybe I should pop out and pop back in, or... You could try that. One thing too, G-Man, you just got the transposing killing. You know the little shrivel dude in the chair? Oh yeah, I want to give that to him, right? Yes, because so, now you can make boss soul items. So you're saying I should definitely go ahead and get rid of these, uh, or should I save these boss souls then? Or these aren't even you boss souls? Save... Well, yeah. Boss souls you should save unless you don't want whatever items he can make from them. But uh, the little soul items, just sort of use them as you, you would use them anyways. So are you saying I should get rid of like the soul of Boreal Valley Vort? Or should I save that? No, 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 no. That's one that you can give to him to make an item. 
if you want the item he's going to make. And what about rotted great wood? So that's another one that you can make an item out of. Well, okay. any of them that are named after the bosses are ones you want to keep. All right. Well, I won't. I won't use those. I my heart's desire is to level up. Thank you for asking. She's always so sweet. Okay. Um. I'm, I'm not. Do you think I should be stamina up a little more? Do you think I need more stamina? I have a lot of health. Well, what's your stamina at right now? I'm at 19. Well, my stamina is 102. My health is oh, 7. You actually... Right? More stamina, right? Well, you actually, you don't have much more stamina or much less stamina. The thing is, is it kind of comes down to do you feel like you need more stamina? Are you liking the amount of attacks you're getting in? For nah, having like to more. wait for your standard region. Yeah, I'd like more. Exactly. Because that's what it comes down to. I mean, I, I could tell you how to build my character. Right, but it, what is my character? What am I feeling? Exactly. <laughs> I mean, uh, the big question is, is seeing as you started as a cleric or whatever, are you using a lot of the... Are you using the healing spells a lot or not? No, I don't even know how to use the stupid healing spells. <laughs> I think I tried... No, you know what? This is a mercenary. I just have him oh, wearing. You just, I'm wearing cleric uh, clothes because oh, it yeah. makes me. Oh yeah. Yep, I remember now. Because I, I feel pretty in them. <laughs> yep, I remember that now. <laughs> Fret not. Oh, okay, here's the translation. So yeah, film. never mind. Ignore what I said. Ooh. Um. Mark and Toast just asked, and it is something to sort of wonder. What is? Do you know what your internet's upload cap is? Uh, that is a very good question they're asking, and I do not know. What is my it's internet? It's probably not something you want to try to check now, because I don't, see, I can't think of how to do it exactly. I don't know if you have to go and check with your provider, or if it's something you can check just some other way. But I know that it's not something that's, like, necessarily something probably too interesting to have doing on stream, but you could check right. it afterwards or something. All right. Well, so he just finished saying a bunch of words and stuff. Oh, shit. Oh, I just... No, no, it's I fine. Should I smack myself? No, no, don't smack yourself. Oh, well, go go ahead. Just a little. Gently. Oh, that was too hard. Did, did you hear? I too me. hard. You smack yourself too hard. <laughs> do do Gee, that. Man, <laughs> I punch myself on at least a weekly basis hard enough to leave a bruise. Don't oh, worry, that's nothing. Okay, all right. <laughs> I'm still not condoning you damaging yourself. Okay. <laughs> So begin transposition. Ooh, shiny. Vort's great hammer. So, like, I can't use any of these weapons except for Pontiff's left eye. Recover that's hit points. Oh, that's a good one. Recover. That's yeah, not bad. Recover hit points with successive attacks. That sounds pretty awesome to me. I'd pr actually prefer that to the um, his great hammer. I don't know. I don't. Hammer sounds like a big, slow, heavy weapon that I don't want to use. Yeah, it's probably not something that you're going to want. Heck, I'm a big heavy strength guy, and I don't even use it, so... So, did I just get it, or... I don't see what happened. It, it said zero souls. Did you... Yeah, did you... Did you say, make this item? I think so. If you did, then you <laughs> have it in your internet. That was or weird. You have, you have it in your internet. It's in my internet. <laughs> oh, no, I've lost it in <laughs> the internet. It's in my internet, and I can't find it. Okay, I'm gonna just let me go to my rings here. Oh, there it is. Wait, it's not. Make sure uh, not to clear your browsing history. Yes. Okay, so what should I get rid of here? Uh, blue tear stone increased damage absor absorption when hit points are low. That's actually pretty cool. Kind of keeps you alive for a couple seconds when you might otherwise not have survived. Increase bleed resistance. Increase fire the damage absorption. The flame stone plate and like the bleed resistance and the flame stone plate are probably the two that you could most easily part with i i myself would honestly get drop the blue tear stone but that's just me but if you want to keep the blue tear stone either the uh either the bleed resistance or the fire would probably be the best to get rid of okay i'll, I'll keep bleed resistance and i'll drop the fire okay all right should i be leaving these in my oh, uh g-man yeah um Wait a second, you're, you're wearing... Oh, no, wait, no, you're not. I thought you were wearing a clutch ring for a second. Never mind. 
Hey man, I'm open to suggestions. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> no, what? If oh. you were wearing a clutch ring, what? One of my messages was raided. Someone likes Ooh. me. I'm gonna run down and say hi to um, this guy. Ooh, creepy guy. Hi, creepy guy. Creepy thief master. Um, have you gone? Have you gone through? Um. Oh, hold on. My guy. Through... My guy's talking at me. Uh, oh, sorry. He's offering me some items that he's stolen that I'm, I guess I'm getting a good... Wow. He's a busy boy. Uh, oh, yeah. He actually gets some pretty cool stuff. I'm, I don't even know where to start. And he gives me a good deal on, um, like, arrows. So that's nice. Oh, yeah. He's... he's like yeah, and his arrows cheaper. are actually better than the ones she sells. You just I got know. really weirdly quiet, G-Man. Did I? That is weird. Mm-hmm. Hey, well, it's, every... it's... I'm sorry. <laughs> Dark Souls is basically Wizards 101 on drugs. I kind of look at Dark Souls as like Dungeons and Dragons. There's a lot of stats. Very much so. I mean, I didn't play a lot as a kid, but it, I did play at some points, and it was a lot of stats and... You know, getting your plus one sword of this so that when you're in an attack, you have that little bit of an advantage. And um, yeah, so I think that's kind of interesting. But um, well, that in direct, some certain monsters are almost direct, uh, direct copies of things from, which is oh, normal for RPGs nowadays. But still, I'm sh yeah. I mean, it's kind of set the it's kind of set the groundwork for a lot of that. So I'm looking at some shields. I love my 100 percent. Um, blocking shield and i wish yeah. there was a way to compare what i have when i'm buying something like to be able to see what i'm currently equipping like if this is better or worse there's no way well, to here, do that, G -Man. well what, what's your currently equipped shield because i probably have it and i can tell you what it is while you're there in the store i don't know <laughs> i don't know what i have equipped hold on i have to i have to pop out to look because i honestly don't know Goodbye. Stay, stay safe. safe. He's so friendly. Thanks for being so friendly. You're a friendly little thief. Ah, you just have the basic kite shield equipped? I think so. Oh, so wait, I do I not have... Oh, I don't have that shield somehow. <laughs> you know, I've plus... It's the Silver Eagle kite shield. Oh, and Silver I... Eagle? Never had to have that. It's, and it's plus... I plus one it, so... Um... Mm. It does 100% physical absorption, which is pretty cool. Um, and then I don't ever use it to attack, so I don't know. Yeah. And it, but it, it weighs well, five the... pounds. That's the that's the. Well, so that's the one thing it sort of comes down to is, uh, do you parry much? Because most of the smaller, lighter shields that give less damage reduction are better for parries so it do you think you're going to be trying to parry very often or not i honestly don't parry that much what i what i do use it for is i just like for some of the lower level guys i just hold my shield i hold my shield up you know and they hit mm -hmm. it and it's 100 percent. then i just whack them you know yeah so exactly I mean, the way i used I, to do it i i don't use it like to do the special parry you know like the the whatever so but lighter would make it me have more. Um, what's the? It would give me more. Uh, you know, more carry weight for other things. You know, if I can find a shield with equal, all things being equal. Yeah. You know. But oh, look at these arrows. Most, nice. Most shields that are going to have a hundred percent. Um, a hundred percent damage reduction are going to be are going to weigh at least the five pounds that that one weighs. So the only way you're really going to probably help yourself there is if you um, were to up your... Uh, oh, which stat is it? Up your vitality so that your carry... so that your equip load actually went up. But that comes down to whether you think that you're really worried about that or not. With my guy, I wanted to wear at least decently heavy armor and such, so I made sure to put up my equip load a little bit. Yeah. 
There's so many things you can do. You can keep the ring. <gasps> I can keep the ring. Thank yes. you. A little trinket of thanks, I suppose. A little trinket of thanks. <laughs> that was so nice of you. Thank you. Very, very polite. And he always wants me to stay safe. I'm going to go talk to my friend Boromir here. Or Gimli. I call him Gimli. Uh, Ooh, Gimli. Oh, Andre. Yeah, Andre the Giant. Another Dark Souls one reference, or not reference, but like dude. Right, he was like one of the other, the guys that, the guy yeah. that in the dwarf kingdom or whatever. No, he was, he was the blacksmith. <laughs> That's yeah, but, all he was in the first one. But wasn't he in, are you talking, are you talking Dark Souls 2? Or Demon's, oh, No, Dark Souls I get 1. so confused. He was, he, <laughs> There's was a in, sec he was the guy in the Undead Parish. Yeah, that's not what I'm thinking of. There's there's the one with like the big golden uh, dwarf robot guys or whatever. And it's the first place you see a fat friar and he's in the top of a tower. Like you run across. They're, they're basically these guys throwing huge rocks at you. These dwarf characters. And they're throwing rocks at you. And then um, you run in and you can either... See, that's an... Demon Souls, isn't it? Maybe it's Demon Souls. Because I don't remember that. And I've played uh... both Dark Souls and... Sadly, I played Dark Souls 2. You didn't like Dark Souls 2? Uh, that's an understatement. I absolutely positively, with every fiber of my being, wow. loathe the Dark Souls 2. Wow. You have, mm -hmm. you have, I like that you're uh, well, feeling free to express yourself. It's good. <laughs> it, it was just such a disappointment after playing the first one. Which this is not. This is making like this game is making me so very happy. Yeah, this is a good game. It feels like it's well. Anyway, so uh, how about infusing? Do I want to infuse anything? Because I heard that once you infuse um, something, you lose. Uh, you end up a lot of times. You end up losing your scaling bonus, which it depends on. Like right now, my character because of the way my stats are. If I was to infuse something and lose the scaling for strength that I have. I would end up losing a lot of damage. But for, say, characters who don't have tremendously high stats, it's actually good to infuse because you end up getting a base damage upgrade straight up. So uh, it depends right. on... Yeah. Uh-oh. Mark Jackson was threatening to kick you at some point. <laughs> he, he, he was, he was, but uh, it's okay. We got over it. Hey, Mark Jackson. I hope you're doing all right. I hope you had a good, wherever you went, the, wherever you are, you're doing good where you are, <laughs> traveling and whatnot. Um, I'm going to go somewhere. Let's do this. Um, I should dump some things first. Too. Let me dump a if few you things want real to. quick. Yeah, I'll go back there. Because I, I want to see if you can, especially with the password thing, summon me up here again or if you're going to have to move on to the next area because that could be fun there's a there's a fun guy hanging out before the next area oh well, i want to find a fun guy okay so all right let's get into this place let's travel oh do i have an undead bone shard no no more that was cool oh if anyone's not hasn't played this and you're watching at any point if you find an undead bone shard man go straight to your local bonfire and burn that bad boy because it it increases the power of your Essence flask which is so cool okay i'm going to dilapidated bridge is that where you told me yeah because i'll put down my summon sign here again and we can see if you can because i don't know if that's going to work because it usually usually you can't once you've been uh once you've killed the area boss but i've never actually used this whole password thing so i don't know if it changes stuff and uh, I, I question for the listeners: How are the um, how are the levels? The sound of the game, the sound of my voice, the sound of Maz's voice. How are you? How's everything sounding? <laughs> like how's Maz sound. singing coming through? Because <laughs> we oh, want to know. Singing. Okay. Okay. Oh, <laughs> so beautiful. You look so beautiful to me. My. Uh... <laughs> if it was going to be there, my summon sign would be right where you're standing, so nope. 
All right. Um, to go to the next area, you're actually going to want to go down through the sewer back over to the tower. I want to kill this guy now. I'm, I'm close. Booyah! I'm a man. Look at me. Okay, sewer. Got it. <laughs> I feel so special. I know yeah, that the yeah. guy's so weak. Going into the stream here, I'm going to run past the giant rat. I don't want to play with him. I don't like him, so I'm going to go this way, right? And then I drop down. I kill a few rats, because rats. Not killing the giant rat, G-Man. <sighs> Coward. Oh, wow. Yeah, it, it, it's really weird. Like, your streams are usually pretty decently consistent, so it's yeah. kind of weird that this one's going in and out this bad. It is weird. So I'm, cl I'm climbing the ladder. Uh-oh. Oh, oh no, no, uh-oh. I was worried my internet dropped out for a minute. Come here, doggy. Come on, jump at me. Jump, jump. Oops, I missed. Okay. Ah, dogs. Always gotta hate dogs in these games. I hate dogs so much. And I know there's a bunch of guys around here. I'm kind of... It gets a little crazy in here, I think. Oh, yeah, there's the whole party that... This reminds me of Bloodborne. The first street you discover where there's the whole crowd of people walking, you know? Yeah. It's sort of that, that vibe. They're just kind of on a path. and. Okay. Tell me where to go. I'm here now. I've killed the rat. The tower? I'm... No, I'm not... Do I need to get to the tower? Yeah, the tower is where you need to go. You need to go down in the tower. Oh, okay. I don't think I've done that yet. Do, should I just run past these big bull guys? Yep. Into the into the tower. Uh, oh, this... I just got racked. Thank you for that, big bull guys. <laughs> yeah, they can be annoying. They just, oh, this they guy. They do so much damage. So there's this guy here with a big weapon. Does he get up and help me or no? Oh, probably. you haven't you haven't bought the the key to the sewer yet, have you? I haven't. Oh, you might want to go do that. Crap. Because uh, there's an important NPC and such to get there. All right, let's do that. I don't think I have enough money. Uh, you have some soul items you could use, possibly, if you need them. Okay, well, let's, uh, let's talk, friend. Hopeless. He's not offering me anything. No, no, he, he talks to you, and then you can walk over to the, uh, to the little hole in the wall. Uh -huh. That's there to his, uh, yeah. his right. Oh. And he'll say a couple other things. Does not open from this side. Okay. So now I go back and talk to him. Mm-hmm. You like poking around in Oh, cells. you like poking around in cells, do you? How very genteel. Okay. Not sure if that's the word I would use. You've taken an interest in her, taken have you? In her, if you? I guess. I don't know. She's a lost cause. She can't <laughs> even become a firekeeper. Beyond repair, I tell you, he says. Uh, okay, but I'm going to keep talking to you. Um, so, it looks like the, the stream is still being weird. Do you do you want to try to... Do you want to try to uh, stop it and it? start it again and see if that helps? I can just do that from here, right? I won't lose where I'm at or anything, huh? Yeah, no, let me try no, that. you won't lose where you're at in the game. Hey, everybody, I'm going to dump the stream and jump back on and just see what happens, Okay. Uh, we'll see what happens. Here goes. Good luck to us. May the may the best man win. <laughs> okay.